We we had to dust this one off, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, it's been a while. It's been in the yeah. corner somewhere. Okay. Ready? Get ready. <coughs> Time now for the top six picks. Yeah. According to Business Insider, consumers are expected to spend a record. Get ready for this. $10 billion on Halloween candy this year. Halloween candy sales have already surged, jumping 29% from last year. And so we wanted to know, we asked yesterday, what's your favorite Halloween candy? Bill, what is up first? Okay, so uh, we're going to run this down for you, folks. From your responses, we have gathered all the submissions and determined the top picks. Here's some honorable mentions. They include Sweet Tarts, Payday, M&M's. Uh -huh. Okay, so Payday was my favorite when I was a kid. I also like sweet tarts. Well, then again, I love all candy. So I, I like candy corn. I like yeah. Crunch bars. Yes. I like O Henry bars. You don't see O Henry bars. I was going to say, where is O Henry? Oh, Henry. Oh, Henry's <laughs> over the hill. He's gone. I haven't seen no Henry in. Oh, I don't know how long. Yeah. <laughs> the candy corn now is pretty much sticking around year round. Crunch mm -hmm. bars, Kit Kat bars. And from our Canadian friend of the show, Mitchell Creasy. Oh, that explains it. The O'Henry bars. Oh, They okay. must be a popular treat. And still in Canada? In Canada. That's where they all went. Oh, Henry. He's up there in Canada. Okay. All right. But the second most submissions were Snickers. Mm-hmm. Used to be a, that was, that was my number one bar was Snickers. Here too. they are right here. I'm always. Does everybody um, go through phases where it's a different bar depending on yeah. what time of life it is? I think that is the case. Yeah. I'm lucky because in my household, apparently I'm the only one that enjoys the Snickers. Oh. So that's good. they get they get left for yeah. me and I try to convince myself that because they have peanuts in them. It's it's, it's protein. Yeah. You, yeah. you want to turn back into Betty White. You don't want to be the grouch. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The overall favorite. Drum roll, please. Drum roll. <laughs> this one was submitted the most time. Reese's. Shh. <laughs> yeah, I'm not surprised at all. And I don't like Reese's. So my kids loved that fact. I love Heath bars, love Kit Kats, love Whoppers, love pretty much everything else. Not a peanut butter guy. Oh, see, cool. see, peanut butter's a, a meal. Precisely. I know, Precisely. I know. I'm the only one in the world. No, Matt so, doesn't care for it either. Yeah. But. So peanut butter, that's like watering down chocolate as far as I'm concerned. But I do realize that it is by far the number one. So, Not as, even close. I, I don't, I disagree. Okay. okay. As the cosmos would have it, mm -hmm. friends, we asked this question yesterday, and a box arrived uh, at our front desk. And I went back after, you know, as I was winding down the day, and opened the box, mm -hmm. and we had this beautiful handwritten note from viewer Garnett Hodges of Dunsville. Mm -hmm. And Garnett shared this story with us. He sent us a box. He sent us this box of zero bars. Like the display box. The display box. Right out of the store. Like also, the box. some bags of uh, oatmeal raisin cookies. Somebody's personal favorite. Yes, He's Bill favorite. and I are gaga for those. Yeah. So Garnett shared this lovely, incredible story. This uh, zero bar was his wife's favorite candy as well. They were married 32 years. He lost his wife in 2019 but said that he enjoys sharing mornings together with us and we have a lot of fun and we sure do. And he sent us the zero bars because he saw them, thought of his wife and thought he loves getting a good laugh with us. So they came our way and that was my top pick, zero bars for my favorite candy. And it's the giant size zero bar. So if anybody has not yet indulged in one of these delicious zero bars, I used to get these with my dad every time. Now I'm going to start to get a little misty eyed here, but dad and I, so they're like white chocolate and oh, there's two, it's perfect for sharing. Here, oh, you already got yours open. Okay. White chocolate and nougat. Caramel peanut almond nougat covered with white fudge. Dad, I haven't had a zero bar forever. Mm. Dad loves zero bars and so do I. Thank you, Garnett, this was a very, very special treat. I took too big of a bite. <laughs> Me too. I can't even wash it down with coffee okay. now. All right, thank you so much. Your letter touched us, mm -hmm. and we love the zero bars. We'll be eating them for weeks, all the time. And there's nothing wrong with that. No meal raisin cookies. Thank you again.
And even though it didn't make the top 10, it's ours so, and yours. So thank you very much. Right here in my heart. You can join the conversation, friends, right now on our Facebook or Instagram page or email us directly, Virginia, this morning at WTVR.com. We still have a couple days till Halloween. Send us your favorite candy picks and next homework assignment, your favorite Halloween costumes. Send those our way. We love seeing them. We may have a little treat planned on Friday. Mm. Well, this is lunch. Yeah, this is it. I haven't had one for a minute.